Hi guys, my name is Muhammad Shahzad and you're watching my YouTube channel Skill Set with Shahzad. <coughs> Sorry. So today uh, there was a lot of comments and people mostly don't understand the networking of uh, uh, VMware Workstation. And uh, as we know, we have installed VMware Workstation from downloaded from Broadcom website, uh, free for personal use. Uh, here. Uh, the most of the uh, uh, things uh, this is the network adapter let's walk through with virtual network adapter this is VMware virtual network uh, adapter so when it's installed by default it will give you two uh, network adapters but you can add one more if you want so you can add if we go to change settings yes it will give us here one is host only the host only mean uh, it's the the adapter which is uh, act as a uh, as a your um, uh, switch more more if you want to um, understand I will uh, try to give you a, a packet trace overview with compare with these three options <coughs> okay so here in the packet tracer if you see a uh, one if I if I install here is my one uh, switch and here is my PC and here is my laptop where the full this uh, whole stuff is installed okay so this is my laptop and I have installed uh, my uh, VMware uh, workstation on this laptop and in the laptop this is this guy here it is a VMnet this one if we go we have our VMnet if I minimize this one this is the VMnet one it is called host only which is totally inside of this VMware workstation this is V M net one which is host only whatever you connect with this whatever device you want to connect with this it will be a host only only they will communicate between these two okay so got it so whatever the host only mean what we have it will be only pings inside so this PC can ping this uh, PC and PC zero can ping to this one only internally. But if we go uh, with the uh, other one, for example, bridge. So what is bridge? Bridge. If we choose a bridge, so bridge is another kind of switch, but uh, it is bridge with your uh, your laptop. Uh, your laptop connector and with your internal connectors like my <coughs> laptop is connected here and then if I choose here a bridge so it means I will connect with my this outdoor bridge with my physical network adapter and in the bridge uh, this is the we call bridge and in the bridge whether my network is going to cloud for example going to this ne my bridge network is going to cloud <coughs> so other one we can connect somewhere there is for example there is no I'm telling you about this so if we connect here with any of uh, uh, this one any anyone this one so bridge mean this this computer my internal it will connect with the bridge and via my laptop's uh, NIC card it will go to uh, the bridge wherever my connection is going so similar here it's like a bridge you got the idea right so this is host only and this is bridge and NAT NAT is totally different NAT is like a network translation uh, means we have another uh, type of uh, switch there and if we connect with this it will uh, internally it will be a different uh, subnet and externally there will be a different subnet for example here 
will be a different and here will be a different so it will create a NAT and then it will do a network translation and it will use here will be a different uh, IP address which is by default in the VMware workstation it will take here from the DSCP built on DSCP and it will translate into outdoor and then it will go out so these are three different uh, stuff I was want to tell you about that this is called NAT and this is called bridge and this is called host only so that's why in the VMware I'll close this one so in the VMware in the VMware we have uh, these three type of networks so it's called uh, bridge so if you want to add another one and then you want to bridge uh, another switch with your uh, PC or something so you can add another network and here is one we can call VMNet2 and it will assign subnet IP to the VM2. Here we go. So here is the built-in DSCP with that. And if you want to use your own uh, a, a DSCP or your own IP schemes, you can disable the DSCPs from here in the NAT and anywhere. You can just disable, apply, apply, and it will be okay. So the second you it will be added into your network so these are the similar networks like we understand what is bridge what is host and what is NAT so this is the basic settings for uh, this uh, whole type of network so similarly we have created a one uh, a window here and if I go add it if I want to do an internal lab only with my internally machines can connect each other so I will choose here a host or custom from the custom I can choose any host only which is one and two which we already used I can use bridge and in the bridge I can show you the bridge is also uh, it is, is, is bridged with your uh, network so we'll go advanced settings you can bridge any any internal to the outdoor one like for example here is the automatic and but I can bridge with my LAN which is my PC's LAN here I can bridge with my my, my wireless uh, adapter too which is already connected my internet is coming here so I can bridge with that any of my uh, host uh, LAN card so then this will be bridged to that and if I bridge this my uh, choose bridge for this Windows 2022 so when it start it is automatically bridged with my wireless and then it will automatically get the IP uh, for the internet it will get automatic so these are the stuff for the bridge so if we change again so these are the three things we can check from here related to network so okay guys uh, hopefully you have understand what is the bridge what is the NAT and what is the host only in the sense of uh, VMware workstation and how we can use them to make our beautiful lab hope you guys you like my video and uh, if you like my video please do not forget to subscribe my channel hit the bell icon for upcoming videos take care bye bye